is really on the table here is whether or not with sanctions and the costs of war, just the costs of losing people and fighting in Ukraine, that coupled with economic sanctions can uh, inflict enough punishment on the Russian people and the oligarchs that they rise up against Putin, right? Th this, is, this is the question. And I think there are two reasons that's not going to happen. I I'm not saying I'm right, you're wrong, but I, I think that what the scenario that you two described will not prove to be correct. And let me tell you why. The first is nationalism. States are able to sustain huge amounts of punishment and the population does not rise up against the ruler. You want to think about what we did to Japan in World War II. You want to think about what we did to Germany. You want to think about the literature on sanctions, economic sanctions. Look at Iran. It's amazing what we've done to Iran. Look at Cuba. There have been sanctions on Cuba forever, right? And these countries don't throw up their hands. So the first point I would make to you is nationalism is a very powerful force. And I think that the Russian people will rally around Putin. Second point I would make to you is, as a result of this, uh, uh, this talk that I gave that's ricocheting all over the internet, plus the New Yorker piece, I get, I get like a thousand emails every day. I can't even open up all the emails I get. But I've gotten a number of emails from Russians. These are educated people uh, who are not hostile to me in any way. And I read those emails to say that you want to understand that you Americans are threatening Mother Russia. And what's going on here is not simply a case of Putin misbehaving and us liking the Americans. And what's going to happen here is we're going to overthrow Putin. The emails I'm getting, and this is not a scientific sample, but it is consistent with my general point about nationalism, is that the more we push against the Russians in Ukraine and the more we threaten the regime, the more that people will rally around Putin. Now, again, I could be proved wrong on that, but my bet is that he'll be able to withstand the sanctions. And by the way, this gets to Ray's point. Ray's point is the Chinese are going to help him. We know the Indians are going to help him. We've heard that the Mexicans are going to help him. So it's not clear that we'll be able to punish him that much over the long term. But then again, even if we do punish him, do you think that's going to bring the Russian people to their knees or Putin to his knees? I wouldn't bet a lot of money on that.